hello guys welcome once again and welcome to my channel today in this video i will be showing you how you can set dynamic size of text field in jasper report or any component of the jasper report so let's get start with the video agar aapne mere channel ko subscribe nahi kiya hai to channel ko kare subscribe aur sath hi sath dabaye bell ka icon jisse jab bhi main naya video dalu aapko notification milti rahe so guys this is my project and this is my report now i want that like suppose uh, this is my ad visitors address and i want that like suppose uh, address is coming dynamically and the address is big so i want that it should automatically increase its size so let me just show you what's happening right now i'll just run my project and i'll show you so let's say uh, i'm i'm adding a new uh, new visitor here let's say dan and it, he wants to meet alan and uh, i'll just set a different uh, email id and right now i have just uh, 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 copied a big paragraph uh, for three or four lines and i want to set this contact number as i'm just giving a random number here and i'll just write the purpose of the meet is meeting and i'll just add this i'll just uh, select the date here and i'll just add this so guys let me just show you what's happening and what need to be done here so guys you can see here uh, address is coming only one line i want that like suppose address is in three or four lines so it should extend the size of i mean height of his uh, attach field so how to do that let me just show you what you have to do you have to just close this you have to go back to your uh, report and you can see here uh, so visitor address you can see you have to go to the xml and in the xml you have to search for address and you can see here i am uh, you can see here is the text field where uh, we will be using address here this you can see here so in this uh, text field expression you have to put a code what code you have to put you have to put let me just show you stretch so firstly you have to set it to stretch with overflow and here you have to write true okay guys and now just uh, we'll just check once whether it's working fine or not i'll just run the program and i'll just uh, you know print this report from here i want it uh, so it's saying some issue here so i'll just close this let's check out what's the problem so guys the issue is like uh, is stretch overflow was written true so instead of capital t you have to write it here small and i'll just save the report i'll just go to the designer tab and i'll just save it again and i'll just run my program and let's see what's the changes i'll just uh, print this report instead of adding a new entry so guys you can see here uh, uh, you know the data is coming you can see properly but it's overlapping the other text field so for that what you have to do you have to go to the again report and then instead of uh, like you know on on this meet to meet whom and uh, all this you have to select uh, at once and then you have to go to the properties and uh, you have to set the position to float you can see here position type float so you have to set it to float and you just save the report uh, then after that if you can't see uh, option uh, position type option in the settings so what you can do you can directly go to the xml and you can just you know search for the field whatever field you want to you know you are setting and you have to just uh, in the report element you have to write position type float like this and it will work so i'll just save it and i'll just run my program again and let me just show you how it's working so i'll just you know print this report instead of adding a new one again and let's see how it works so guys you can see here 
I have set the address field as dynamic size. You can see now it's not overlapping. You can see in this way you can you know uh, set the dynamic size of a text field of uh, or any component in the Jasper report. So that's all in today's video. If you like the video, don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to share my video. Thanks for watching this video and bye for now.